Blue Marlin is a semi-submersible heavy lift ship from Dockwise Shipping of the Netherlands. Designed to transport very large semi-submersible drilling rigs above the transport ship's deck, it is equipped with 38 cabins to accommodate 60 people, a workout room, sauna and swimming facilities. Blue Marlin and her sister ship MVA Black Marlin comprise the Marlin class of heavy lift ship. History Blue Marlin and her sister ship were owned by Offshore Heavy Transport of Oslo, Norway, from their construction, in April 2000 and November 1999 respectively, until July 6, 2001, when they were purchased by Dockwise. The U.S. Navy hired Blue Marlin from Offshore Heavy Transport to move the destroyer Ossa Cole back to the United States after the warship was damaged by Al-Qaeda suicide bombers while anchored in the port of Aden, Yemen. During the latter part of 2003, work done on Blue Marlin boosted its capacity and added two retractable propulsors to improve maneuverability. The ship re-entered service in January 2004. Following these improvements, Blue Marlin delivered the oil platform Thunder Horse PDQ, weighing 60,000 tons, to Corpus Christi, Texas, for completion. In July 2005 Blue Marlin moved the gas refinery Snarl HVIT from its construction site in Cardiff to Hammerfest, an 11-day trip. This transport was filmed for the TV show Extreme Engineering on the Discovery Channel, and also the TV show Mega Movers on the History Channel. In November 2005, Blue Marlin left Corpus Christi, Texas, to move the massive sea-based X-band radar to Adak, Alaska via the southern tip of South America and Pearl Harbor, Hawaii. It arrived at Pearl Harbor on January 9, 2006, having traveled 15,000 miles. In January 2007, the Blue Marlin was employed to move two jack-up rigs, the Rao and Gorilla 6 and the Global Santa Fe Galaxy 2, from Halifax Harbor to the North Sea. On June 16, 2012, the ship arrived in Feral Harbor in preparation for transporting the amphibious warship Hamasa Canberra to Melbourne, Australia. The incomplete Australian ship was lifted onto Blue Marlin on August 4, 2012 and was scheduled to sail on August 12, bound for Australia BAE Systems Shipyard in Williamtown. The ship passed the Port Phillip Heads marking its arrival in Melbourne on October 17, 2012. Specifications, initial, length overall, 217 a.m., length pp. 206.5 a.m., breadth molded, 42 a.m., depth molded, 13.3 a.m., summer draft, 10 a.m., dead weight, 56,000 metric tons, submerged depth above deck, 10 meters, free deck length, 178.2 or 157.2 a.m., free deck area, more than 7,215 AM2, main engine output, 12,640 a kilowatt, bow thruster, 2,000 a kilowatt, cruise speed, 14.5 knots, cruise range, 25,000 nautical miles, accommodation, 55 people, building yard, CSBC, Kuxiang, post-2004, depth, 13.3 AM, max sailing draft, 10 AM. Max draft submerged, 29.3 a.m., water above deck submerged, aft 16 a.m., forward 12 a.m. Deck space, 63 a.m. a, a 178.2 a.m., deck area, 11,227 a.m. 2, propulsor output, 4,500 a kilowatt each, conversion yard, Hyundai Maipo dockyard, Alsen, South Korea, see also, Dockwise Vanguard, Mighty Servant 1, Mighty Servant 2, Mighty Servant 3, Semi-Submersible, References, AB Bessel Info, Blue Marlin, DNV Exchange, Detnosk Veritas 2011, Retrieved March 4, 2011, a, Brian Whitaker, Attack on the USS Cole, The Bin Laden Connection, The Guardian, Retrieved September 9, 2012, a, Nina Berglund, Snow White Gets Her Heart. Afton Possen. Retrieved March 5, 2011. A, El Blue Marlin Permanus Dest Air A Trocado en Navancha Fin Diario de Ferrol. June 17, 2012. Retrieved June 27, 2012. A, 
Navancha Efecta Econa Copyright Xito Alo and KG Della Canberra. La Pina Cubed NCORUA Plus or Minus A. August 4, 2012. Retrieved August 6, 2012. A. El Blue Marlin Zarpara N7 Da as Haitian Australia. La Voz de Glissa August 6, 2012. Retrieved August 6, 2012. A. Orange Giant Blue Marlin floats into Port Phillip Bay. October 17, 2012. Retrieved October 17, 2012. External links, professional photographs from shipspotting.com, Rigzone article about towing the Thunder Horse PDQ oil platform.